So it's going to do a walk around um, in between the rain showers. I think we've gotten over the past three days like four inches of rain. So it would have been more of a wade instead of a walk. <laughs> but I had to run into the RV because it started raining pretty hard. So I'm in our RV. Um, it's kind of 70-ish. It's an older one. Um, but what I wanted to talk about today when I was walking or waiting um, was going to be labels. I'm going to tell you I'm not a truther. I only know my own truths and the truths of those who are I'm familiar with or I know personally and um, and from the research I have done concrete evidence where or my friends have done where they've had things tested such as snow from chemtrail fallout they have had tested and I know for a fact what's in there also our soil the pH in our soil was wrong so we had to remove a half a foot or no a foot excuse me of dirt am I correct Kenny? yeah we took about a foot off the top to get down to the real dirt yeah we had to take a foot off the top to get to the real dirt and and it corrected the pH with some stuff we put on it which was organic and we grew an organic garden now the reason I'm not gonna be labeled a truther is because truthers seem to believe that government and hence I'm gonna say it again and you guys know this uh, to govern is to control mint is the mind I am not gonna be a subject to mind control I'm not a truther I just search for my own truths they're my truths um, that's all I can do the truths that I was brought up with everything else I know how corrupt the mind controllers are so I'm ungovernable I had to come to that conclusion a long time ago I just didn't know the words to use until Clee Bentley the Navajo good Navajo Indian sent me the shirt and it is we are ungovernable and that's the only way to live free no labels no labels we're all unique and different and we all hold our own truths and we can contribute that to one another um, I cannot manage you or you cannot manage me we're all individuals um, that's actually what I was going to talk about today so as far as the truther thing I think that's an Alex Jones coin term to get some kind of message across I, I could be somebody else's but I'm not part of the truther movement I'm part of searching for the truths that are in my life and what I have found to be real and not real I, I'm also searching for the people who don't want to be governed and and actually have found a, quite a few that are ungovernable besides the Native Americans and I'm very pleased about that I don't need a police I don't need the police force telling me what I can and can't do common sense will tell me that I don't like the fact that they're militarized. I don't like the fact that they just randomly murder people who have done not one thing wrong. That is my stance on that. Um, I don't even want to go into immigration because a Yakima man, um, he was a uh, Yakima Indian, was in the... Um, the Cascade Range picks, picking stuff for a ceremony and the Forest Service came up and told him he was an immigrant so uh, that was like a what the fuck that happened last year so what is an immigrant to begin with are the first peoples here immigrants now um, so I was going to talk about immigration at one point but I can't because I guess now we're immigrants my my ancestors are considered immigrants um, <clears throat> Actually, I think everybody's on the reservation. If you really look through it very hard, what happens on an Indian reservation eventually happens to the rest of Ameristan or America or the USSA or USA or the damn corporation with its CEOs and all them. And who's behind them? People say the bankers. Well, who's behind the bankers? There is some people behind the bankers. Um, and a friend of mine on YouTube is going to do a video, and when he does, it's about a law firm mm, that kind of controls a lot of the stuff going on, believe it or not, for the UN. First thing we should demand as free people is that 
we want nothing to do with the UN. The UN is a very big problem. Um, and when this person puts up this video, I'm going to give him a shout out and let everybody see the video. Um, because it was too big of a rabbit hole for me to go down, so I asked someone who's very good at at doing this. Actually, and it was the Mohawks who made me aware of a law firm that seems to run every damn thing. Um, but at this point, the label I would give myself is ungovernable, free person, human being. And um, I'm ready to meet other ungovernable free people, human beings. Um, and I think that's going to work out great. I think a lot of us have a lot of things in common and we'd probably have great conversations. Uh, right now we're having genetically modified weather, I'm sure. I can hear it raining and I'm in the RV. Uh, once the raindrops stop falling so hard, I'll run to the house because um, it's crazy out there. I mean, we're going to get another two to four inches of rain, I hear, over the next few days. So that'll be like six or seven inches of rain. Not that it's not needed here. It's just we have we have pretty deep puddles everywhere, so I would have been waiting instead of walking. But um, everybody, I just wanted to tell you, I'm not a truther, and um, I hope that's okay with you guys, because your truths are yours. My truths are mine. Um, and until we talk, I mean, it's a label anyway. Um, we need to become unlabelable, um, if that's a word, ungovernable. We need to live so damn free. Our very existence intimidates those in control. And I'm not saying break their their flipping laws, but if you don't give your implied consent to some of these policies, then you're part of the problem. And we're going to have to speak out loud. I don't give my implied consent on anything they're doing. From this health care monopoly, which will turn into universal health care. Obamacare was designed to fail. I promise you that. All you have to do is go back in history and look at the research of how this came to be. It starts in the 1800s. Um, and it was going to come this way, but all they want is universal health care. And that is a big problem in itself. Um, I won't go any farther. You'll have to do your own research. Um, I can't do it for you, so you can find out your own truths and what it means to you. Because you would just be getting, in my humble opinion, truth. Um, I do love all you guys. Um, I hope everybody is safe. I know that the East Coast is getting bombarded again. On the West Coast, we were expecting a very big wind event last night. The night before, we did get it. Last night, I didn't hear shit. It was windy a little bit, but not like they said. But we got massive rain. But um, I do love everybody. Couldn't walk today. Would be waiting. Um, so I love you guys and um, we're cleaning up this RV and trying to get it in really good order. It actually was cleaned up. Kenny kind of made it a man cave and um, I want it cleaned back up because this needs to be just ready to rock and roll at any time. I'm out of here so hope everyone has a wonderful day.